one of the things that uh, we taught a lot about this offense was how to use footwork when you catch the ball at the wing. And one of the things about it, the footwork is you give the team two seconds, a two count to organize itself. So Jordan's assessing using footwork and allowing the players to get into position. So when he comes up, he can see where the defense is as opposed to what the offense is gonna take advantage of. That's just mental penetration with the ball and Harp not wanting to hang out and take a shot from the outside dive cuts and has a, an obvious dunk at the basket. Let's go back to the start of that sequence here and see how this unfolds. Guard quickie, weak side wing sneak. You can see Kuko just clearing this area here so Jordan can come off this pick and go to the basket. It could be a lob if it's available. That's too long a pass for a lob, but it's also an isolation. As the trial gets organized here and Kukoc takes the ball into the wing position, Jordan steps up and sets a back pick. And this is the corner series. Kukoc makes normally should be making a baseline cut but Robin's a little bit high, so he cuts over the top and it sets up a screen roll in the corner, which is an obvious open opportunity for Robin, who misses the first attempt, gets the second. Last seconds of the third quarter. There's the, what we talked about before, middle penetration, a fan pass to a reset of the triangle. There you see it, reset. Jordan has gone to the post has the option to make passes out of that position to clear space for him. He knows he's got plenty of time because there's probably our last shot. And maybe overpass the ball a little bit that time. Let's go back to the beginning of this sequence so you, you can see all the activity that goes on here. This is strong side entry, strong side fill. We set up the triangle. Kerr looks at Burrell on the weak side. He's overplayed and comes back to the curl cut here. You can see the Pippins on the curl cut, which is one of the options. And Tony steps back behind that curl cut and he's got obviously a shot here, but he puts the ball down. Clock's starting to run out on this and Steve keeps the ball moving. And now it becomes a solo. This is what we call a solo with a singular post and wing entry guy. And now it's gonna be a squeeze cut with Burrell. And it sets up Steve Kerr. Dennis opts to go weak side for some reason. And uh, I think he just jumped the play a little bit before it had an opportunity to work. It's basic action. It's strong side entry by Steve Kerr. He's going to make a strong side fill to the corner. Kukoc makes two pass to the top. Burrell comes to the, the pinch post. And both players go with Pippa coming off pinch post. And Scott Burrell has an open layup to drive to the hoop. Here's your basic triangle. Two pass to the post. Wing entry. And this is a squeeze cut again. We talked about that before. Girl makes a step through off a screen. 